Guadalupe is the biggest barangay in Cebu and is well known for the Guadalupe Church, its cave, the scenery, and its sweet mangoes. But in the upskirts of Guadalupe, in a small city of Napo, lies the start of something else that Guadalupe is known for, the Guadalupe River. The Guadalupe River is considered to be biologically dead. However, to the locals, they use it on a daily basis. But despite the clear water, it is not sure whether or not water here is safe for use or consumption. Water supply is still scarce as the government can't reach this portion of Guadalupe and plastics and other waste can still be seen in this side of the river, especially at the river banks. Piggeries and duck farms and even the uphill mango farms can contribute to contaminating the water, especially as our test shows high levels of phosphate. <laughs> Our solution for this problem is to create an artificial channel connected to the upstream portion of our river in order to divert the flow of water into our retaining pond. This solution does three things. First, it minimizes the chances of flooding downstream due to the upstream area. Secondly, it helps with the infiltration of water down to the groundwater table for future use. Lastly, it filters out the water by the sand and the vegetation such as the umbrella plants to absorb heavy metals and the sweet flag plant to absorb phosphate. Our goal is to find a solution for the water crisis starting in Napo. To give people hope that like the clear water in their wells, the future of Guadalupe River is bright and fruitful. All it needs is to take a step. <laughs>